Hi friends and welcome back to Samarth Projects and today I am going to show you Celestia. So Celestia is a 3D astronomy uh, software program. So let's get started. Hi friends, so now you, as you can see I am share screening. So to download Celestia, you have to go to celestia.space slash download.html. So you have to take your operating system and uh, download that. So as you can see, now it is in Celestia Setup Wizard and you have to click next, click I accept the agreement, click next, click next, click next, click next and click install. So now Celestia is extracting the files, program files and all. So I don't want to view readme.txt. If you want, you can activate this and after and after uh, doing or completing the Celestia setup, you can click finish and now Celestia opens. So now this is how Celestia looks. So as you can see, we have the information of the real time. You can see and here the information of the planet. So if you want to see a solar system of planets and moons, you can just go to navigation here, go to solar system browser and you can do it. Suppose I take it as Jupiter, click go to. Now suppose you want to view Jupiter moons, you can just click on this plus button like, uh, like in Saturn, so I take it as click go to. As you can see, that is showing the moon of uh, Saturn. So now if you want to see some stars, just go again to navigation, go here to star browser and you can see something like this. And now you have to go here to take any uh, star that you like. Like I take it as this one and click go to. As you can see, you know, it is viewing that. So you can see the brightest, you can take it as option or else with planets. Like I take it as least 1317. Least 317. As you can see, it is showing. So this is very easy. So if you want to find an eclipse, no solar or lunar eclipse, you can just go to navigation here. Go to Eclipse Finder here, the uh, uh, last option here, and now you can do it. So if you you can see now searching for a solar eclipse, you can search it for a lunar or solar. Then you have to click Compute. Now if you want to change the planet, you can just go here to this option and you can change it. Now click Compute and you have to go to Set Date and go to Planet. So now it's a go to. So now if you want to change this time as you can see now if you want to freeze the time or else make it a little more faster just go to time go to faster as you can see now this one is becoming uh, the time is going more faster so and if i keep it slow it is going slow or else i can just freeze this time that means the time is paused you can see it's showing here paused next if i go here to this one I'll just click that. If I go here to real time, it will start showing me the real time. And if I go here to reverse time, it will start to reverse the time. I'll just keep it as that. Like that. And I keep it as so. So next is uh, view. So if you want to change the view and all, you can just go to view here and you can spread this horizontally. I do this. You can shift this one and even move this one. Like, okay, or else you can just go here to split vertically. It will now split vertically. Next, if you want to uh, delete all of these, you can just go here to delete active view. It will now start deleting or else you can just go to single view. It will automatically delete all of them. So if you like this, so before that, if you want to take a screenshot, you can just go here to file, go to capture image, and you can write. 
right suppose i write it as paste one and click save now that image had been saved now if you can i want to capture a movie you can capture that like this and all so if you like this video please put that subscribe button and notification bell so you can notify when i upload my videos thank you for watching